The new Combi QB project was a major challenge with a very tight deadline, but we had no trouble in meeting it. From a technical point of view, it was, of course, a challenge to fit together all the components of a fully functional brew house so as to meet the stipulations for brewing between 50 and 100 hectolitres of wort. It all started when the drawings arrived on the shop floor. The team displayed admirable motivation while tackling this new project. Thanks to very close liaison between the production and design people, we can manufacture the Combi QB using the very latest technologies. We can deploy the laser and the hood drawing machine so as to assure consistently high quality, substantially reducing the lead time and the manufacturing time concerned. During the Combi QB project, we realized that small breweries' requirements in terms of production output and quality are different compared to their big counterparts. They're often run in single shift operation, a single person is responsible for all the specialisms involved, and the variety of different beers is much greater than with the big breweries. Seasonal fluctuations are routine. The idea behind the Combi QB is to provide far more flexibility in terms of production modes and production volumes. Each vessel incorporates the innovations taken from the large brew houses we supplied in recent years. For example, the combined mash work ton features the dimpled heating surfaces that ensure exceptionally gentle heat transfer. An optimum has been achieved for the wort and mash quality. The wort and mash hardly get baked on at all, and this means you don't need an intermediate cleaning procedure. The next step was to erect the fame, which had been fully assembled within three short days. Then the vessels were brought in. The principal components of a brew house, like the mash tun, the lauter tun, the wort copper and the whirlpool, are installed on a freestanding frame. All the other equipment involved, the piping, the pumps and the heat exchangers, are pre-installed here in the factory. The brew house arrives on site fully assembled. Krohn's has expanded its product portfolio to include its globally validated technology in an extremely compact construction with minimized erection and commissioning time. Gradual expansion of a facility or capacity right sizing at a subsequent juncture or changes in the diverse product range, all these can be done at any time. This means that breweries can now opt for the Combi QB as a wise choice for the future, not least in terms of the energy costs involved. What we really like is the innovations that have been introduced over recent years, and they've all been incorporated in the Combi QB. I'm thinking of the Pegasus raking blades, the Stromboli nozzle, the floor of the mash tun. All that has been integrated into this small size system, just like the big breweries have. What's important as far as I'm concerned is that the figures are right, by which I mean the cast-out quantity and the range of different beers. We're the only brewery in the UK that brews beer in conformity with the German purity law. It's important for us, of course, that we can brew in Scotland as well the kinds of beer that are savoured in Germany. And I think this system is going to manage that just fine. For industrial applications in particular, I think convincing performance, fast throughput and a minimised footprint are very, very important. For the mid-tier breweries, particularly for smaller system sizes, this is precisely what's needed, compact and modularized, just the ticket, and all of it harmonized, of course. That's very important when you're going to be running relatively small batches. What we like best about it is that it's a system in an order of magnitude that we, as a mid-tier brewery, can actually use. Now, we can really take advantage of large-scale type technology. 
but on the basis of a cost situation that we, as a medium-sized company, can actually afford. It's really fantastic when you take a look and realize that this here is some really sophisticated technology. Und die Kostendegression aus diesem Standard ausnutzen können. Das heißt also, wir können uns das auch wirklich leisten, da rein zu investieren.